So another week in the bag. That one seemed to fly by and it wasn't too bad actually. So I was a little bit happier about that than the week before because that one was really pants. Um, but this one I sort of wanted to be a bit more productive and a bit more positive. Sort of sort my head out a little bit. So we decided to put pen to paper and figure out what reopening would look like for us. Um, going off what Boris said and pubs would be able to open the earliest 4th of July. We feel like that's far too early for us. Um, we are thinking maybe August, but only for the Pig and Whistle, which is the biggest of our three venues. Mainly because it has more space and we could remove tables to make the social distancing um, much more viable. We're obviously hoping that would by then it would only be one meter social distancing rather than two because I think that makes a massive difference. We've done our math and we think that we would lose 30% of our sales. We're very lucky that we don't rely heavily on Friday and Saturday nights. We have quite a good regular trade um, throughout the week so we can spread it out quite nicely. We were thinking having one person on the door to seat people and host one behind the bar and then one doing the waitressing on the floor. We would have to upgrade our PDQ machines to Wi-Fi based ones rather than phone line, but that's sort of, and obviously sanitizers and gloves and masks, but that would kind of be the only costs because we don't have money to make structural changes and we don't have money to buy the screens, especially if it's only something, hopefully, that would be a temporary measure for the next few months. So we're hoping to give the pig, pig and whistle a go and see how that works out for us. Um, the old sergeant relies heavily on televised sport, which would obviously, we'd need massive crowds to make our make our money. Or also sports teams that play locally. And again, they probably won't be playing if pubs have to socially distance. So we couldn't have those large groups in even if they did play to start with. So there would be very little point opening that full time. We were thinking maybe opening a couple of hours a day for the regulars because the pub is spacious enough that they could socially distance from each other but still be able to enjoy a drink. Um, the Ram Inn, which is the new one with the brewery, is a social distancing nightmare. The bar is massive so you can't really walk past the bar and the tables without uh, without bumping into somebody because it's also um, bench seating so that one we will have to lo uh, leave for a while and hopefully when everything calms down we'll be able to open that one as soon as possible having that focus and going through how our tables are going to look and how we want everything to to function and the structure and the setup and the layout just gave us a bit more of a focus this week and gave us it just made me feel a little bit hopeful even though we know we have to be flexible and it might change and we can roll with that but it was just having something to focus on and knowing that this will come to an end and that made all the difference this week so i hope you guys had a better week as well and i'll see you next week